Okay, welcome back. My name is Mark Tolliver, and we are in the middle of doing a podcast series now all about intentions and circumstances and values and what our values are all about. And also with the last podcast, I had talked about volume, where you created with your values create volume. So how I was explaining that in the last one and how I'll explain on this one is that how do you create the volume out of your intentions to create your goals in life? How can you be aware of exactly how much your values fill up your life? I had given an assignment on my last video and if you're listening to it for the first time I do recommend that you go back and listen to either the last video or the entire series. It's They're not long videos at all. They're all about seven minutes to ten minutes long. So I'm going to go into exactly what I assigned was to, on a piece of paper or in your journal, to draw a cup. We've all heard the expression, my glass is empty or my cup runneth over. And for that, we really want to see what's going on with our cup, what's going on with our values, and what's going on with our lives, and how much we put into that. What's the percentage that we put into our cup? So I'll grab my piece of paper that has my cup on it. Where did it go? Here it is. Okay. The cup. Not a great drawing, but I value this cup and my life trying to put it towards the camera here against the light, which is probably at a 75%. That's how I rate what's filled up with me right now is about 75%. And what did you all get? Or if you're drawing it for the first time, what are you getting? Shadow in with a pencil or with a pen how much of the cup that you have that you fill your life up with. Think about your values first. Then bring it up to the intentions that you want to set forth for this new year, for this year, and go on from there. And let's really focus in on how full that cup is getting. Is it dry? Is it at the very bottom? Or is it running over? And if it's running over, how is it running over? Is it running over in the sense that there's so much that you have to grab another cup or you have to really focus in on how that abundance is coming in your life? Or is it not filling up at all and how are you going to fill up that cup? Or maybe it ran over for that first cup but now it's kind of hard to get that second cup to fill up or maybe it's filling up where you have to get a third cup. So I'm a coach and I love to talk about awareness and being aware of how that is running for you. How that's running on your roadmap of life. That's why I like to assign these homeworks. Or to be able to assign or to have you carry your journal and really focus in each day on what the circumstances are coming into your life. There's a lot that comes into your life. It can be negative or it could be positive. So once again, visualizing on that cup, what percentage do you give that? Because that's the volume that is created in your life of what you want to do in your life, of what you want to do with your intention that you're setting forth, that this class is what it's all about so you can get to your goals. <laughs> so what is that cup saying to you? I want you to share that with me, and some of you have already shared with me in my blog, as well as on Facebook, as well as the rest of the links below, and some of you have even emailed me, and we've had conversations about it. So, which, again, I want to add is an intention, is an action to create a reaction. You wrote something down on my comment section below this video, or you have actually reached out to me and personally emailed me from my email box that's down below that's created to Life Creations Education. I'm a coach with Life Creations Education. And now we're going to see how that cup is running and how we can create more of that or how we can follow through. So once again, this is just a quick little check-in just to see where everybody is at 
and where everybody's going and where that cup is. And what I want you to be able to focus in on for the next video, we're going to be talking about how that volume is divided with productivity. Because now we create this volume to create this active and productive way. And how are we going to use that? How's it going to follow through? How do we get to the next cup? How do we fill up our first cup? Or even to be able to fill it up a little bit all the way or all the way through. As I said, my cup is 75% full right now. Yeah, it's not spilling over. But I'm aware of where that is for today, for this week. Next week, it might be 100% and it's running over because I'm hearing back from all you guys and hearing exactly what my teachings is teaching you right now. So, focusing on that cup once again, and I'm a coach, so I love to give homework, so I'll give another little piece of homework, which is, let's now combine that cup with your values, with the volume that's growing, and let's now focus in on that productivity. How can we be productive with this? How can we be active with this? If it's starting to create volume, then how do we now push it out there again with that action to create that reaction? So think about that for this week. And once again, journal about that. See that glass flowing. See that glass flowing into another glass. And is it starting to stop or is it continuing? Because once again, our values is our foundation and anything can grow up from that foundation. Okay. So join me with the next set of videos, and I will see you next week. Keep that cup running. Fill up that cup. Aloha.